Welcome to Blindside. Hi guys, came across this really cool indie game called Blindside and it's very different because it's a horror game but it makes you feel as though you're blind so there's no visuals whatsoever, it's all audio. It sounds really creepy, you know, not actually knowing what you're scared of and just hearing it. I don't know much else about it, I just know that. Starting new game. Good morning. What am I doing? Oh! No kidding. Can't see a thing. Let me get the flashlight. Batteries must be dead. Are you okay? So weird. I can't tell if I'm moving. I'm gonna get the matches in the kitchen. I'll be right back. Okay. Storm must have knocked out the power lines. Press X now to skip the tutorial. Press escape oh, at any time tutorial. to go to. <laughs> What the hell? What's wrong? Um, I'm not sure. Let me, uh, let me check the hallway real quick. Damn, damn, damn. Okay, the apartment door is just to my right. <laughs> okay, so I'm outside of my apartment and there's someone crying. Sh should I go towards them? Hello! You should be Thanks. right here. Cindy, is that you? Canise, oh, I'm so glad it's you. I, I think I'm blind. I, I woke up and I can't see anything. Can, can you help me get to the hospital? Damn it. Dawn and I can't see either. We need to call 911. Who's there? Yes. Arnold? Case. What's that noise? I'm coming, hold on! Ah! Wrong apartment. I need to get back in the apartment, not closer to the carnage. Oh, sorry. Die. You have died. Loading <laughs> last saved checkpoint. I'm an idiot. Shh, shh, Dawn. I'm here, okay? Look, I'm here, there's Dawn. something out in the hallway. It got Cindy. I. Close my eyes. What do we do? I'm thinking. Let's ah. on the fire escape. While we're blind? Do you see another choice? <laughs> okay. Let's do it. The window's in front of me, next to the bed. Okay. Ow! Damn, coffee table. Damn, coffee table. The window! Yeah! You first. I don't even remember what it looks like. Just go! I don't know why I keep on looking at the screen. There's like no point in it. It's just a black screen. Groovy go, music. Go, 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 go. You okay? Everything in one piece? I think so. What was that? I don't know. We need to get help. I brought my phone. Oh, you're awesome. <laughs> so bad. You're awesome. You're, you're awesome. The number you have reached has been disconnected. Mm. Damn. You're still awesome, but we need to get to a landline. <laughs> or we could just yell for help. Listen, though. I don't think anyone is out here. I don't even know what time of day or night it is. My guess is if we get hit by whatever's going down the street, it will kill us, because that's apparently what things are doing now. Okay. But who has a landline anymore? There's one in my office. You're talking to the person with the worst sense of direction here. Okay. My apartment building. Oh, right. A traffic pool. <laughs> I'm in a traffic pool. Anything, though. Loading last saved mm. checkpoint. Is this supposed to be cars? Man, there. Man. You have died. Loading, Loading last saved checkpoint. Why is there two people? You, you, you have died. Ah! 
I don't know what I'm doing right now. It's a subway train. Ah, ah. Just sitting. Okay. I got somewhere. It's better than nowhere. Ah! No! I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I hate not seeing things. You have died. Ah! You have died. Loading I can't cross the road. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, here we go. Here's a fountain. I think. Now we're going to keep zooming things on our right. The fountain behind Why us, you... and we're going to walk to the arts and sciences building. Hold on, please. Listen. Do you hear another monster? Please don't. Silence. No people. Nothing. We should keep going. Master! Okay. So they don't like water? Like in science? Don, what is it? Sorry, I, I tripped on something. It's stupid, stupid. I think it's a body. Let me check it out. What is it? <clears throat> it was one of those campus police. But there's not much left. It's like he was eaten. Zombies! But I got his gun. What are you gonna do with a gun? Oh. You never even held him There's before. a gum? Yes, like, I have. And he fired it. When? Time crisis? I'm serious, Case. You're gonna hurt yourself. Look, I'll be careful. I promise. If you had heard what had happened to Cindy, I... Well... Let's just keep moving, okay? Okie dokie! Finally, we're inside. Progress! This is a long, skinny hallway with offices on the left and right. We can follow it down to the ballroom lobby, go through there, and get to my office in the hallway on the other side. Well, I don't hear anything trying to kill us in here. There's still time. Let's just find the landline. Okay, let's go. Hello? <laughs> it's really unnervingly quiet. Shh, don't move. Oh. I... Shh. I don't think I we're think in danger, gone. Dawn. What did you hear? I don't know. I just didn't think we should chance it. That wasn't one of those monsters. I know. Let's just get to your office. Okay, quietly. Ooh, what? I don't understand what's going on. I hate not seeing things. Damn it, the door to the lobby is locked. Hey, we can go through the ballroom. Is there another way around? We can go through the ballroom itself. The ballroom door should be on the left side of the hall, towards this end. This way. Towards the music. Is that towards the music? Music. Finally, here it is. What's that smell? Mass smelly socks. Don't don't the door. Sorry, it's locked. Shh. Listen. Breathing. This place smells like those monsters. Uh oh. I guess we'll have to go through. You gotta be kidding. We should be able to just slide along the back wall to my right and go through the door on the far side. How many of the monsters are in here? I don't know. A, a lot. Saving checkpoint. What do you think that the monsters look like? To me, they look like gruffalos. You're like, uh oh, don't know no, that way. No, <laughs> like, shh, don't back away slowly. It's a sleeper. Okay. I don't think I woke it up. Do you remember the layout of this room? It sounds like we might be clear towards the back wall. I'm pretty sure it's just a big, empty room, except when they set up tables for events. Let's head towards that steam sound coming okay. from the radiator, and then over to the music coming through the far okay. door. Just don't hit any more monsters. Yeah. Follow the music! As I was saying, I see them as gruffalos. Like, really big, with sharp teeth, and like, brown fur, but kind of cute. But obviously, they kill you, so... Yeah. This is not going as well as I'd hoped. But I'm just following the steamy sound! I suck! I suck! I suck at being blind. They're all around me! Go back! This way. Towards the music. Those days are gone. Good choice. If it's that song. Is it? 
I don't think so. I reached it! The door's unlocked. Thank God. Whew. Goodbye, monsters. Do you think they were hibernating? I have no idea. I think we're safe for the time being, though. Hmm. <sighs> The acting. I wonder what horrible thing's gonna happen to us next. This hallway is pretty much like the last one. I'm, I think I've just gone like. Where's your lamp? Oh, here we go. On top of my bookshelf, which is against the back wall, directly behind my desk. Do you want me to help look for it? No thanks. I think I'm getting the hang of this. Ready? I don't remember leaving my wall stereo on. <laughs> you do without that? No, leave it on. What's that beeping noise? Oh, it is in the cave. I thought like my fire alarm was going off and I was like, oh shit, I'm inside playing on games. My antique drawing desk, I missed you. Uh, what? I was just talking to my desk. That's gotta be some sort of cry for help. It's just really odd how they're so like optimistic and they're like, yeah, it's fine, we just lost our eyesight, we're just gonna get killed, it's all good. Okay, where is my bloody... The phone is on my left, somewhere. Ah, <coughs> oh, thank God! What? The phone's dead. Or something. The circuits are probably jammed. What are we gonna do, Case? I'm thinking. I'll tell you what you're going to do. Ah! Jesus ah! Christ! <laughs> Colin, is that you? I'm so glad to hear you, Case. What? Don? Is that you? I'll tell you what you're going you to guys? do. Um, okay, I guess. Besides being blind, unable to call for help, uh, oh, having our neighbor torn to shreds in the hallway, and dealing with the end of the world. I mean, thanks for asking, Professor Scaris, to death. Not so good. Can you see? No. I'm blind as a bat. I take it you are, too? Yeah. We were asleep when it happened. We came here because there was something in the hallway that ate my Funny we had Sonic. So I guess there are more of them. Senses. Well... I was working late, around 11 o'clock, I heard thunder, I saw a blue flash, and then everything went black, car accidents outside, etc, etc. That was a couple hours ago. I've heard the creatures stalking through the hall since then. I take it that's what got your neighbor? Yeah, do you know what they are? No, I thought maybe escaped zoo animals, but they just don't sound like anything I've ever heard before. And if you listen carefully, they make these sharp clicks. Creatures, get out of the view of the door. What? Over here. Oh, no. In the corner. <laughs> my voice. Okay. Saving checkpoint. Ah, thank you. Where's his voice? Over here. What are you waiting okay, for? I'm coming. I think. Over here. <clears throat> what are you waiting for? <clears throat> Case. I suck at this so much. It's like, how many times can you die you being have blind? Died. Loading last save <sighs> checkpoint. Ah! No, I can't do this. Ah! God, you why do I died. suck at being Loading blind? Last saved checkpoint. <laughs> what are you waiting for? Now don't move. I worked! <laughs> Is it gone? We lost him. Their sense of smell is... it's terrible. Good. That explains why they smell so bad. What are we going to do? We're going to bait to one. To do! Capture it. Study it. Kill it. And then eat it. What? I'm kidding. We're not gonna eat it. But we are going to catch it. You're insane. You actually sound like you're enjoying this. He is. Alan might be a mild-mannered biology professor during the day, but he lives for cryptozoology. His last sabbatical was spent at Lockhart's I don't care. with a harpoon gun. She's right though, Alan. You can't let this one go. Think about it. Something big has happened. We all know it. Those creatures are everywhere. There's just too many of them. Those creatures are everywhere. I'm we just to too cool to are. actually talk and, and open my mouth properly. The only other real option is just to be a total chicken. For the last time, I am not chicken, Alan. I'm Case, I love you. 
But this, I can't. Come on, Don. Oh, we need you on this stupid one. Stupid girls, they always ruin Don. things. Give us a bad Don. name. You know what? Screw it. You both are insane, but it's not like oh. I have any other options. Go. I'm in. Let's Come catch on. a monster. Excellent. Case, I told you she was a keeper. I'd hug you, but I'd probably just poke you in the eye. <laughs> oh, God. Accident. What's the plan? Follow me into the hall. Okay. I'm going to close my eyes from now on. Hear that beeping way at the end of the hall? Yeah. That's the fire alarm control panel. I thought it was a fire alarm. One of us is going to go down there, attract a creature, a specimen, you might say, and then a run specimen. down the hall in the classroom 201A, which is connected by a door to 201B. One of us will slam the first door after you and the monster are through. The other one of us will slam the other door between you and the monster, trapping the monster in 201A. Uh, did you say you? That. I absolutely would be bait, but my knee hurts, so you're bait. Dawn's on 201B. Your door. knee hurts, and you called me a chicken. I swear to God, <laughs> Alan, if Case gets hurt, I will kill you. He'll be fine. Good girl. I promise. I Case, love you, baby. Follow me. I'll walk you through the escape path. Dawn. Don't, Case. I'll see you soon. Okay, I'll. I'll yeah, don't like offer kill to you, do it for Alan. me or anything. Kill you. Come on, Case. I cleared out most of the desks earlier. Wait, you've been planning this? Yeah. Anyways, give me a hand. We need to move the last two desks. Alan? Yeah? Why do you think we went blind so suddenly? Do you think we'll get our sight back? It could be osmium tetroxide. It turns your eyes black on contact, even very tiny amounts. We have some in the lab. That is horrifying. I thought it might be a leak, but between the car accidents and you two going blind, plus a big question of what the hell those monsters are, I'm going to guess that, isn't it? Good? Maybe. Oxidation by osmium tetroxide isn't reversible, and that level of exposure would probably lead to pulmonary edema in the next few hours. My second guess is some sort of radiation. The blue flash can be a This guy just sounds like a stoner, like he doesn't sound like he should be this intelligent. Just Neither like of those sound good. Babbling on about yeah. scientific Either stuff. Be, follow me on into the next classroom. I'm stuck at this. The classrooms in the Arts and Sciences building are pretty much all the same. There are two doors on the wall that are shared with the hallway, and two windows on the opposite wall. I need to find a desk to move out of classroom A. The desk is in front of me. Where the bloody hell is this desk? Where is this desk that you speak of? I need to find a desk to move out of classroom A. The desk is to my right. It's not though. <laughs> One of the last two desks. Oh, the desk is in front of me. Room. Am I doing it right? Connecting the classrooms. Now to drag this noisy desk out of this classroom and into the pile of other desks. The objective is in front of me. Am I going the right way? All I hear is like. <sighs> One down, one to go. Yay! Uh, classroom B. Really? Now I've done this before. I just have to drag this desk into the other room and put it with the others. Now I'll be one step closer to running for my life. Again, on purpose. The objective is in front of me. Oh, okay. Mm. You can't move though, it can't be in front of you, you retard. Sorry. That's not a nice way. Into classroom B. Imbecile. Uh, Okay. Oh! Can you go close and lock the two doors in the other classroom? Oh, really? Then meet Dawn and I back here. I want to check the escape path. There are two doors that lead to the hall on the south wall. It'd be such a shame to trap the creature in there just to have it waltz out into the hall and tear the flesh from our bones. Good. Such a shame. I hope you have the keys. Kind of sliding along on this. South wall. It's the one that's shared with the hallway. <laughs> Okay, I gotta close the door. One door is to my left. It's definitely around somewhere. Wall, connecting the classrooms. Great. Hallway. Both doors are okay. locked. I should head back to Alan and Dawn in the other classroom. I just keep on pressing H. I'm such a cheater. I can't play this properly. I am just suck at being blind. How do people do it? I have high respect. Closed okay. south wall classroom A. A radiator. Oh gosh, it's just too hard. 
It's so weird. It's just really surreal playing a game the and West not Wall, looking at anything. You're know, not. It's really odd. Just heightened oh. senses. Where am I going? An overhead projector. I need to head towards Alan, some sort of a plan, and probable death. The door is behind yeah, death. me. Don, Don, oh. I want you to start yelling to Case when you hear him enter the far side of the room. Case, just aim for Don's voice. Okay. Fine. Keep the probable sound of death. the wind on the right and just head for Don's voice when you get in here. It's a straight shot, so you should be fine if you just aim. Okay. Follow me down the hall to the first door where I'll be standing. Don will stay here at the second door. Okie dokie! <clears throat> Come on, Case. Just say it more. Help me out here. North wall. Uh -huh. Come on, Case. You just go like left to right of me. Are you like behind? North wall. A window on the north wall. Alan is in front of me. No, he's on, not! Case. I'll be yelling for you oh. to go through here. As you approach, you'll have to aim slightly left of my voice because I'll be behind the door. What if the creature stops and eats you? What's with Dawn? She's just upset on account of this entire situation. Plus, what? She thinks what? you're a bad influence on me. Why? I have no idea. Huh, weird. Anyways, got the plan? I think I know yes. why. I bait a creature at the beeping control panel, run by you to Dawn. Ready when you are. Hey, do you know how to use a gun? Let's go. Of course. Point it at something and pull the trigger. You have one? Come on! Yeah. Well, Stop being so slow and to cast it. Let's just go. Let's do right. this. And case? Yeah? Alan C. Thanks, Alan. This is the what open does that mean? What am I doing? Too late now. Time to head to the fire alarm console. Okay. Oh my gosh. I gotta turn around and run as soon as I pull this. Okay. Here we go. <sighs> I think I'm running in the right direction. I don't know. Go through here. Oh no! It's breaking through. Do something, shoot it! Ah, but shoot it! it! Don! 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 I'm okay. Oh, I did it! I'm okay. I'm so. Yes. Me too. I'm also not dead, more than I can say for our friend here. Jesus, uh, that was loud. Wow. This thing is all teeth and claws. Dexter's fingers, teeth and claws, thumbs like human hands, but four-inch claws that extend over them. This is incredible, absolutely <laughs> incredible. Quadrupedal, in a matter of speaking. Is it a gruffalo? What is it? It's alien. It has to be. There's nothing like this on Earth, or there wasn't before a few hours ago. How do you know? What do we do? Maybe they're in hiding. Just let's listen to music. Thank you for playing Blindside. You've completed episode one. Blindside is a game developed by Aaron Rasmussen and Michael Tiastalvi, featuring Michael Tiastalvi as Case, Michelle Ciata as Dawn, Paul Reznikoff as Alan, Andrea Kornstein as Cindy, Thomas Stalvi as the voice of the emergency broadcast. Okay, right, so enough of the dads. Like, that was pretty cool, wasn't it? Um, it wasn't as horror as I'd like it to be. I would prefer it to be like totally crapping myself, but I think they put a bit too many jokes but at the same time it was quite entertaining and it was really different and that's what I love about it and that's why I needed to show you guys so yeah I put the link in the description so you can have a go I'm sure you're better than me because I'm just stuck at being blind give it a thumbs up if you liked it have a lovely day or evening bye I'm definitely gonna put the game down because it sucks and then suddenly you start doing well and you're like <laughs> I'm like a genius like now look at me oh my god 